So, hey guys, Chelsea here, back with another episode of Far From TM, and this time we're going to use the Trashy Map Booster Unluckies, the, we're the lowest point booster from Trashy Map Weewee. And outside of Trashy Map, they remove 3 turns of paralysis and do some damage and nothing more, sadly. So yeah, we're going to see if Hawkins can carry the unluckies to victory. But as always, I refuse to put units on a team doing nothing, so they will have some minor use in this run. But yeah, uh, the main issue with using Hawkins for Garb Challenge NL is that uh, their special does nothing against NL. Unless you want to stall two turns, remove the death up, and uh, rainbow shield and uh, the spear. Because it takes some damage from an Elden and you can use their special and do some damage, but not enough. Because an L removes all previous stored buffs when you enter the stage. It is what it is. But yeah, we're going to stay here for a little bit to take some damage. Uh, Hawkins is a bit faster than like we 2 category. It doesn't need to take as much damage, but it needs to take damage anyway. But it can take a bit of time sometimes because, you know, it takes some time to enemies to be able to attack you. But yeah, we finally re reached that point. And yeah, we'll take out one of them so we can survive the second hit. And of course the good thing with Hawkins is that all damage we take will just heal back when we move on to the next stage since we're running double Hawkins. And yeah, we're going to stall a little bit now so that we can use Hawkins for the reminder of the run. We want to try and set it up so we can have Hawkins for all stages except for the final stage. So we're going to stall a little bit here, we just want to do some prior damage. So yeah, might as well use the ship here, we mostly use it to get some extra damage. And yeah, might as well take some extra burn damage, we're going to heal it all back anyway. And yeah, we'll get paralyzed now, but obviously we have the unluckies and they can remove it. So we can move on to next stage now. And we've done a good bit of stalling now. I'll just stall a bit more because I want to try and take out the quick guy here. Uh, because it's not reliable to kill this stage in one turn with talking special, so the less units we have to kill, the better. Yeah, just a little bit more stall. But this is how it's like when using Hawkins, they just stall is his game in the end. But yeah, we're moving on now. But yeah, I love Hawkins for this stage in particular. I've used Hawkins as sub on other Dex teams for Garp Challenge and all. And it's very nice, just use Hawkins the previous turn. Then you get here and the extra damage will easily take out the ball guy. And yeah, we, we used holy support on... He also, just for the Hawkins super type, just to get a bit extra damage from the extra affinity. Yeah, there was no reason to really stall there. Moving on. Uh, I think when I did this run, 
I had this idea that I wanted to try and keep full HP for final run, but of course that's not possible because we have pudding support on Sora and Sanji, so yeah. So I stay here uh, a bit longer than I had to, but yeah, whatever. But honestly, I spent a lot more time with this team than I planned to. Uh, I tried a lot of different stuff. This wasn't even a Hawkins team from the beginning. I tried using Kid and Hawkins together. Which would have worked. It's just that I wanted to carry the unluckies. And it didn't really work with uh, one member not really contributing much. And yeah. Finally move on to final stage. And of course, Rayleigh is going to do an ore boost. And chain lock. Uh, Sora Sanji going to do an attack boost for two classes. Will cover most of the units here. He also, of course, gets rid of the special bind. Since he has Fear Sailor with Limit Break expansion. Sadly, no. Uh, color affinity since Dex has no support for color affinity final stage right now. Or they do have it now if you use a kid unit due to Kamasol. So yeah, I thought I was like, oh no, not again, I didn't kill. I I already thought the run was over here, like I had to do it all over again. But yeah, the extra stalling I did last stage ended up paying up because I realized uh, Hawkins is going to be ready now and Enel is going to damage us a lot. Can maybe Hawkins do it? And also the ship removed the barrier. So I was like, is it possible? We like kill through the despair, the death up, the rainbow shield. And yeah, so that made me really happy. So yeah, thanks for watching. See you guys next time.